in a move that has shocked most of the boxing world, pound for pound king and unified light heavyweight world title holder Andre Ward has announced on his website that he is retiring from boxing at the age of 33. Quote, I want to be clear. I am leaving because my body can no longer put up with the rigors of the sport and therefore my desire to fight is no longer there. If I cannot give my family, my team, and the fans everything that I have, then I should no longer be fighting. People see what I do fight night. They see under the lights, but they don't see the toil. They don't see the grind. They don't see just the pain, the physical pain that you go through. Not just in the fights, but to prepare and to get ready for those battles. I felt the physicality of the sport, not just in the ring stuff, but the training and the preparation start to take its toll on me for the last two or three years. And I bit down and continued to push through. At this point, it's time, and I know it's time. Ward's contract with HBO... Uh, recently ended and um, he had been uh, hinting for years that he had been uh, mulling retirement and he finished his career with 32 victories no defeats and 16 knockouts and his career culminated with a brilliant 8th round stoppage of Andre Kovalev in a rematch to a disputed decision uh, I think it was split decision for uh, Andre Ward in the first fight. In the second fight, there was no doubt Kovalev uh, lost the second fight. And uh, I'm going to end this video by saying that I know there's going to be some people out there. Andre Ward had his detractors and his haters, which doesn't make sense because he never was a controversial fighter. He wasn't a guy that talked a lot of trash, from what I understand. Um, but you have people out there, especially in the boxing world, who are racist. And if you're saying that, you know, by me saying that makes me racist somehow. That makes me a bad guy for pointing out the obvious. But um, they're going to come with some narrative where, well, Andre Ward retired because he's ducking Triple G and Canelo. You know, he, he got scared of what he saw the other night, and he's ducking. He's put his tail between his legs, and he's hightailing out of boxing. When, well, in reality, if I'm Andre Ward and I looked at that fight, I'm licking my chops because both fighters look overrated. Because if Andre Ward was able to defeat a man, Kovalev, who was a better boxer than Golovkin and a harder hitter than Golovkin, a guy who killed the man in the ring, Basically. Do you think that he had problems against Triple G? And with Canelo, look how Canelo gassed in that fight against Golovkin, despite being a younger guy. Andrew Wood would make quick work of him. So that's just my opinion, at least, but I think it's the opinion of many people who uh, at least somewhat follow boxing. So with that, Best wishes to Andre Ward. A magnificent career. He will be in um, the Boxing Hall of Fame. And uh, tell me what you guys think about the great Andre Ward, son of God.